and pull the tool from pull the tool to come and I'm gonna shoot tonight that uh, set us two gold works for Mac well it's already work for Mac but I just added to the porting kit and I'm just gonna show you how to do that um, first you need uh, um, a couple of things you can uh, use or uh, combination set us two gold which you can get from here or um, from uh, uh, in combination with crossover where you can purchase uh, on uh, on the Code Weaver's website, um, read everything about uh, about it here. You can even got 25% uh, off the portal promo code, so uh, it's very uh, very good. Um, then. Uh, You can use this combination. So uh, with the crossover and will work out of the box. So you can install it in crossover and then you can double click it to launch the game and it will work uh, straight away uh, out of the box after installation. So uh, as you can see here. <laughs> uh. All right, have a quick straight away because uh, Alright, so this is crossover. Anyway, uh, that's the easiest way, just um, install and play. Um, or you can use the porting kit, uh, which is a bit more uh, advanced uh, uh, to get it working. Um, what you have to do is first get the porting kit, and um, second, uh, the game, of course. And you need Boxer, so you need one extra as a DOS application. So download it and then uh, open it. As you can see here, I have it already open. Um, then, uh, if you downloaded the setup file of uh, Surface 2 Gold from uh, GOG.com, um, you can uh, use uh, the porting kit if you don't have it yet. And then uh, this is the porting kit. You can open it with this icon. You have downloaded it. Um, open it, then uh, it will start on a news. But you go to the library, you go to the server tab, and there you will find uh, um, Settlers 2 Gold. But you'll find it on the, the Settlers. It will be changed, by the way. So, a little mistake that it is uh, visible here <laughs> in this video. You see a whole instruction, um, a written instruction where you can uh, work it out, or you can use uh, this video instruction to do it. Uh, if you click on download, it will uh, download uh, the game. You can purchase it. You click uh, if you haven't purchased it yet, click no. If you have it already, click on yes. Although I already have downloaded the setup file um, into my download folder. So it will launch the setup file uh, straight away. So the body gate recognizes the setup file automatically. So uh, the setup file will start. And the only reason we use the pointing kit is just for the installation uh, uh, itself. So you can use the game folder in combination with Boxer. This will become more clear, more clear when uh, when you see it. First, you're going to install it. Click on yes, install. And this will install the game into the porting kit, but the porting kit cannot launch it yet. So, what do we do? What we will do is after installation, we will uh, navigate to the application folder. I will go there already. So I go to my application folder, I search for the Settlers 2, Settlers 2 Gold uh, wrapper, and exit, don't launch it, click on exit, and then uh, the pointing will say, hey, successfully, it will be added into your local tab. So, um, Settlers 2, as you can see, is already added now. Uh, we right click it, show package content, go to C, 
GG to com games and then sell us to gold. Well, then, well, um, the boarding kit is uh, is out of uh, out of the the scope because we don't need that. We now we need boxer. So open boxer and click on import a new game, and then you can drop your game here. So use this uh, game folder um, and drop it in here. And then it will say it will create the game. And then you see, hey, it's done. And I click on Show in Finder, and I move it into well, the desktop or wherever you want it. Well, close. So from now on, we don't need this game in our local tab. So we say Silent uh, of uh, Settlers 2, remove. Yes, yes. So it's gone. So we don't. And now it's in here. So. If you want to launch it, double click it, then it will ask for, uh, for what, do, what does Settlers, uh, the boxer need to start. And it should launch s2.exe. And then you can click launch every time. And then from that time on, it will launch the game always. And then you can play the game. And if you think, hey, um, I want to play it full screen, well, that's right. You can click on Command F. And it will launch the game to full screen, as you can see. And then you can click on uh, the play, play chapter. Well, oh, uh, house. And then we can build here. Well, it's one, it's one, so compare it yourself. End game, yes. Quit program. And then you can uh, press uh, up command F, and it'll become small again, and then uh, it'll be ready. So, thank you for watching. I hope to see you back on Polotol.com. If you love the work I do, you can always donate to our website and become a premium member support my hard work. And yep, spread the word and see you back on Polotol.com. Bye-bye.